Hello everyone. So I have my interviews coming up, and I wanted to buy a formal shoe for my interviews. And uh, I had a pretty tight budget as always, so I got this shoe from Bata, which cost me around nine hundred. And it is a formal black shoe, and I'll show you how it is. The packaging is very stiff uh, this time because in the last video you saw how you cut it packed it. It was terribly packed. And this one is from Bata. So usually I prefer buying all the Indian brands because. Puma and all that prominent figure it doesn't suit me. I'm making India right now, promoting in India, so let's buy that stuff. So this is the box, and it is pretty, pretty nicely packed. It's a good package, and the shoe cost me right nine, uh, eight ninety nine rupees. The price was nine nine nine, but it came at around uh, eight nine nine because there is an offer on Flipkart which says that if you purchase above five hundred, they'll discount you discount of hundred rupees. So that is a hundred rupees of Snacks for me, I guess. This is the packaging. It looks decent. This is the content of it. You can see, and that is all that you can see from the package. And it says on the package that it costs nine nine nine. And there is nothing on the other side. They they, they are like Apple. They are just brand names on all the sides, and just information on this one. So look, here is a shoe, and here is the shoe that I was uh, talking about, and these. Oh, I thought that they were going to be some normal shoes because the price was really low and it's an original Bata shoe. I thought it might be fake because the, at this range you don't really get Bata shoes and it is really strong. Uh, as you can see from the finish, this one has got a matte finish to it and there is a little bit of rough roughness to this on surface and on the either side it's. Really nicely packaged, and uh, these are the shoes that I was. I thought that I might have to use them for the interview, and then return it back because yes, you all are cheaters, and uh, we might do sometimes we can do that because I need. I, I bought them in a hurry, and I thought that they won't be nice, so I just used them and returned them. But on the on the other hand, I think I might keep them because they are really firm, as you can see from the pictures and the videos. The shoes are really nice. They've got this real feel to it. They're they're hard to bend. There is a slight bending on this one, but these are really nice. So I inspected them, the shoes, and as you can see from the inside, I want to just check them for myself before I showed them to anyone. And here, if you can see closely on the inside, it has got some real nice stuffing of padding inside of it. So. My feet would be comfortable in it, and at the range of, and if you have a budget of around 1,000 rupees, then if you want to buy a sneaker, then watch out my other video. It has got some real nice spark sneakers, and it's really comfortable. And if you want some formal shoes for yourself, and if you're tight on the budget just like me, then I think you might buy this shoe because this is really nice, and uh, I recommend you buying these. The size is 10, 44 numbers, and uh, if you look at them from the front, they are. Kind of old-fashioned because right now the trend is currently of shoes having pointed front and a little bit raised on the uh, raised. But in the end, at the end of the day, you want the feet to be comfortable and the, it is it is slightly wide, so your feet won't be feeling any pain because you will be will be wearing it for the whole day. And you you do need comfortable shoes because at the end of the day, if you don't have them, you'll get annoyed. That is my personal thing because it, I had a pointed shoe in the back and. Whenever I used to wear them for a long time, my feet, the fingers on my sides of my feet, started to ache, and that annoyed me a lot. Because I, my, I wouldn't be showing them, but the annoyance came in me, and I felt that I should get some shoes which might help me in that. And so overall, to end it up, uh, if you have a budget of around 1,000 or in the close uh, 1,200 range, instead of buying brands uh, shoes from brands which are high, like Hush Puppies and all that. Charge you a lot, but if you are buying the lower price of them, like Red Tape, the lower uh, lower shoes from them are not as nice as this. If you go for an Indian Indian brand and purchase them at a normal price, you will get a slightly better deal. If you buy from a big brand, then purchase the higher end stuff and not the lower one. Instead, buy the higher end stuff of the lower brands. So, uh, but I am not saying that Butter is a low brand, but compared to the price that the Red Tape and all the other shoes brand put up, it is completely lower because you can get a shoe around fifteen hundred in Butter of. Real nice quality, 
So that would be it. And uh, I'd be attaching the link for where you can buy it. I bought it from Flipkart because I got it my eight nine nine. You can buy this, buy it at the same price from Amazon, but Flipkart is currently giving an offer of hundred rupees off on purchase of five hundred or above. So try out Flipkart or Amazon, whatever you feel like. You forgot to snap it for a while, so you can check on snap it. But I recommend sticking to Flipkart and Amazon because the return policies and the exchange warranties and all that stuff. And I'll I'll be wearing them for a long time now. I can see that these are really well made. The stitching on the shoes, it's really like you can't see the stitches. That is. They do good stuff. You depend on Bata for that stuff. You don't expect them to do anything that would defame their brand name because th- this looks like a little. It's a little bit thin, but come on, you can at at the price of around eight nine nine. You don't expect that much of a quality, but yes, it is not something that you can ignore. It is really nice, well, nice and well made, and uh, that is what it, I would offer at, at this price. So try try them out. Uh, you have you have the links and. Uh, If you're looking for formal shoes at around 800 or 800, 900, 1000, even if you go down 1500 bucks, I search them a lot for online, and I got some options from Red Tape. Uh, I, there was some name from Red Tape. I don't exactly remember. I write it down somewhere and tell you. But those brands were nice. But Red Tape shoes are real expensive. If you want them to be nice, they are real expensive. And the, the lower end Red, Red Tape shoes, they look like nice in the pictures. But if you bring them to bring them home. They are not exa- like what they look and what we expect from them. It's, instead of being disappointed by buying them, get these Indian brands. You'll be helping out your own uh, the money stays inside the country. So that would be all. I'll be taking some pictures and uh, if you want, I could give you a review after wearing them. Or that would be stupid, but I could do that for you if you want. And uh, check them out. The links are in the description. And these are the shoes that I bought for myself. Thank you.